In the current special military operation, a number of the latest models recently adopted by the Russian army are being tested by real combat work. These include the Engineering Remote Mining System ISDM, Agriculture. For testing two self-propelled launchers agriculture, in combat position, cars are lined up one behind the other, maintaining a safe distance. They are ready to fire in one sector, but the ammunition rail packs are set to different elevation angles. Perhaps, from one firing position, the forces of two vehicles carried out mining of two sections at once. Subscribe to the channel, it will be more interesting. Thank you in advance. With a characteristic noise, the rocket engines turn on, and then the ammunition leaves the launch rails. Combat vehicles start launches synchronously and thus make several dozen shots. Then one of the installations stops firing, while the other continues to launch. Having used up her ammunition, she falls silent and lowers the guide package to the stowed position. Meanwhile, another ISDM resume is firing. In less than a minute and a half, including breaks, the two agriculturists fired a hundred rockets. This means that they have completely used up their transportable ammunition. However, after replacing the guide packages, which requires only a few minutes, the combat vehicles can again carry out mining. The firing range, the type of mines used, the configuration of the obstacles and other details remained unknown. At the same time, it can be assumed that the barriers created by two ISDM agriculture are fully consistent with the current situation on the site and should have the required effect on the enemy. A promising remote mining system using the principles of rocket artillery was developed over the course of the 10th years at NPO Splav named after A. N. Ganachev with the participation of other organizations and enterprises. All major design work and testing of new technology were completed by the end of the decade with all the required results. On June 24, 2020, the first samples of agriculture were shown at a parade on Red Square. The first production systems, agriculture, entered the combat units in starting from 2020, a new type of equipment regularly participates in various maneuvers. Since last year, serial vehicles of combat units have been involved in such events. As part of the exercises, all the main characteristics and capabilities were confirmed, as well as new methods of using equipment were worked out. During the development of ISDM agriculture, a number of interesting ideas and solutions were used. It was due to them that a high level of performance was achieved and wide working and combat capabilities were obtained. In addition, significant advantages are provided over other domestic remote mining systems. The main advantages of agriculture are associated with the chosen architecture. In fact, this system is a multiple launch rocket system for a special ammunition. It is capable of sending dozens of missiles with hundreds of mines on board to a given area in a minimum time. At the same time, the jet launch method gives a firing range of up to 15 kilometers, several times higher than that of other mining systems. A 122 mm rocket for agriculture can carry a payload in the form of mines of various types and for various purposes. The exact types of products used have not yet been named, but it has been reported that only modern products equipped with a self-liquidator are used. Each projectile carries several mines and scatters them over a certain area. All technical information about this system is strictly classified for now. Ready-to-use ammunition includes 50 shells, which simplifies the setting of large barriers. The missiles are placed in launch rails assembled in two transport and launch containers. The installation is recharged by replacing the TPK, which takes only a few minutes. A new fire control system has been developed for Zemladelia. It includes satellite navigation and weather sensors, a computer, aiming controls and other equipment. The FCS automatically calculates the data for firing, taking into account the task, the ammunition used, etc. It is possible to create minefields of different sizes and shapes with a given ammunition density. Mining maps are also automatically created and transmitted to the command post. ISDM Agriculture is built on a four-axle truck chassis with high cross-country ability. Such a machine is able to quickly move on roads or off-road. This makes it easier to quickly reach a given position and leave it after firing. In addition, the carrying capacity of the selected chassis made it possible to place a significant ammunition load and all the necessary devices. Thus, agriculture combines high mobility and speed, 
a significant ammunition load of shells and mines, flexibility in creating minefields, etc. Both independently and in combination with other engineering equipment, this ISDM is capable of restricting enemy movements and reducing its operational capabilities, helping its troops to defend. Don't forget to subscribe and like.